you are watching Redicon. So I'm going to talk about some uh, abutment syndromes or infection syndrome. What happens is uh, in a positive ulnar variance, as you can see on this radiograph, uh, with repeat, rep repetitive micro uh, trauma or movements or stress, you get cystic changes on the ulnar side of the lunate. Uh, so uh, you get this radiolucency on radiograph. If you do an MRI, you see this marrow signal changes on the ulnar side of the lunate, uh, and you see the cystic changes on the stir or water sensitive sequences. So immediately your eye, you should be thinking about abutment or infection syndromes uh, due to abnormal uh, anatomy in this region. What else you can get is you can get TFCC injury or tears. So you can see here there is a small central perforation in the TFC disc, so it is likely a degenerative tear. Again bit more expensive, uh, extensive, so you can see cystic changes within the lunate with some marrow edema. Uh, there is positive ulnar variance, uh, again appreciated on the T1 weighted sequences, there is marrow signal change on in the lunate and uh, there is a mildly positive ulnar variance, so that is a case of uh, uh, ulnar abutment syndrome with secondary osteoarthritis. Next uh, infection syndrome is ulnar starlight infection syndrome where this ulnar starlight process is slightly elongated and with the time and with micro trauma or micro repetitive stress you get cystic changes in the trichotrum with soft tissue reaction, thickening, bit of synovial thickening and some marrow edema in advanced cases uh, and that is a case of uh, ulnar infection. In this case again I think there is some uh, ulnar lunate abutment uh, or ulnar carpal abutment as well, so you can see there is cystic change in the distal ulna and there is also cystic change in the trichotrum. I suspect there is a central perforation in the TFC disc here as well, so you can see I cannot see any TFC between the ulna and the uh, lunate on this image. This video is presented in collaboration with Radicon Institute of Radiology. You are welcome to subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on the notification bell for updates. For more modules in radiology CMEs, please visit our website www.radicon.org.